Hey folks, I uh, just wanted to share with you guys today the top five features of F5's advanced web application firewall. Now, if you were a previous ASM or application security manager owner on F5, you are now entitled to a free upgrade to AWAF or advanced web application firewall as of April 1st, 2021. Exciting news. In this video, I wanted to talk through the top five features that you'll find inside of advanced web application firewall. And maybe those are things that you'll get to put to use right away. First feature is the OWASP top 10 dashboard. Now previously with ASM, people would ask, hey, how do I configure the OWASP top 10 type of protections? Well, with AWAF or advanced web application firewall, there's actually a dashboard that's built in that takes you through all of the options that you need to turn on in order to have those protections in place and gives you a really nice to read scorecard. Second feature is the layer seven behavioral DDoS mitigation. And this is really cool in that it creates dynamic signatures on the fly for DDoS attacks based on layer seven traffic characteristics. Next feature is threat campaigns. Now this requires a subscription on top of advanced web application firewall, but what it gets you is a subscription feed of signatures downloaded from the F5 threat intelligence team. Now these signatures are a little bit different in that the threat intelligence team has honeypots around the world. They're actively looking for attacks coming in and they will be able to create signatures for active and ongoing attacks and then push that down to everybody who has a threat campaign subscription. This subscription also entitles people to dynamic bot signature updates as well. Now the next top feature is API security. And what you can do is you can take an open API file or swagger file, upload that into AWAF. And now you have the definition for the API already inside of the web app firewall. And then you can apply protections to the API based on that information. Now the last top feature that I wanna mention is deception mitigation. And I really like this feature in that instead of having a blocking page that shows that you have a web application firewall in place, you can actually have the AWAF throw out generic server error response codes instead. So you could say 502 bad gateway when somebody's actually getting blocked by the web application firewall and then they don't actually know that you have security in place. Kind of sneaky, but kind of cool. Now those are just my favorite features inside of AWAF. There's a lot more features inside of there. So let me know if you have any questions. Again, anybody who had ASM previous to April 1st, you just go reactivate your license. You'll have AWAF now and you can take advantage of these features. Let me know if anybody's interested in the threat campaigns or bot signature subscriptions. Also, there's another subscription called IP Intelligence that has categorized bad IP addresses. Let me know if you're interested in that. You can implement those into your web application firewall policy. And otherwise, we'll see you on the next one. Bye now.